All right, boys, another day, another video model. It's like a running joke, I think. We talk about image models a lot. We talk about LLMs a lot, but here we go. Mid Journey. Mid Journey's got a soft spot in my heart. I do really, I've always liked, it was probably the only image generation tool I used, and I guess I did a lot of YouTube thumbs with it. They now launched a video module. Obviously, they were going to, like, it was just a matter of time. Yep. But look at this. The internet, as expected, did not disappoint. Reddit exploded with nearly 3,000 likes in a matter of hours. Here we are, boys. This is it. Oh. I actually really like the UI. Not that that's what this video is about, but I really like how they've built it. Have you not used it before? Uh, I only used Discord. I haven't touched Midjourney in a long time. Oh, oh, Tigus is very similar to Ideogram. Yeah, this is cool. Look at that, bro. How long to all like, you can see a different data set, right? Yeah. It's trained off like really beautiful images that everyone's made. VO's more like we trained off actual video footage. Yes. This is like fantastic. Oh, oh, that's, that almost gave me a heart attack. I'm like, is, oh. Wow. Crazy. Yeah. So, I mean, this is their, you know, I signed up for this two seconds ago. So this is what they just show you straight away. This is mental. Like it's oh, so, oh, that's so amazing. Oh, uh, like, why is it going in reverse? But that makes no sense. Awesome. <laughs> oh, what the heck? That's a new little creature of a small gremlin. Is it so funny that VO is so realistic, but my, I feel like my reaction to this was way bigger. I was like, yeah, because it's creative. It's fun. I think yeah, like, mid-journey's always taste. Hey? Yeah. Oh, no, it's got taste. Yeah. Look, the old. Oh, right, that's oh, oh, yeah. oh, a little Testarossa auto drive. Dude, the AI audio music channels, like... Night drive music things, they're gonna get so good. Oh my boys, get some new video. Yeah. That's the first time I freaked out over Boca on AI. What the F? Look at the way it lost in space. Yeah. It shouldn't be doing that. That's too good. <laughs> But yeah. Hey, real quick, our crew's mission is to build the ultimate content OS. Think of it like a single purpose-built place for you to manage all your projects and all your content team. So if you're a content creator or maybe you make content for other people, check out Clipflow. Turn that chaos into calm. All right, back to the lads. Oh, I just a giraffe chilling in a car. Just have the mount. Uh, shit. Um, question, no audio, I'm guessing? Uh, no, no audio. Yeah. The audio would be so spooky on some of these. Look at those cars. The freak. Okay. That is a stacked deck. Uh, is it lots of aces. Oh, oh cheating. So is someone too. Dude. dude. Like, I don't look at it and think it's realistic. Any chick. And maybe it's. Oh, yeah, bro. It's the same girl and everything. Yeah. Yeah. They only used one girl in the model. Yeah. <laughs> Just like. <laughs> right there. Oh, dude. AI UGC people are going to lose their marbles if you can put a product into that. Oh, yeah. Right. Look. Oh, look. Sorry, we just got cop fun, all right? Why is that? Oh, so like, look, oh, Stalingrad. Did you? Yeah, that's that's dumb. That's so sick. Do you think there's something to be said? At, like, we expected it not to be real, so expectations were different, and now they're blown away. That's the uncanny valley thing. If you try, if you generate actual humans, it's very hard because it's very easy to see what's wrong. Generating this stuff is like, it's meant to be slightly wrong, so it's better. That's cool. Oh, yeah. I sound it's like where, where AI human generation has arrived at like a, it's clearly AI, but it looks realistic enough, but it's clearly AI. But then like some of them are like, that just looks like a real person. That's like a Gucci commercial right there, dude. Which I just saw Gucci dropped like a crazy commercial with all this like VFX. And I was like, it looks like Miley Cyrus and AI. I don't know if you guys saw that. It's literally. Oh, I love these. Oh, oh, that's that, cool. It's so good, eh? Oh, poor little guy. Can't the get grumpy up. face plus rooster toy. Oh, oh, for the fire. That's so cool. Wow. Yeah, it's my crazy man. Very awesome. I want to see this stuff in our, in our videos, boys. Yeah. Like, how do you get a little bit of B-roll? Obviously, Dude, maybe not the main goose. If there's not a Tyrannosaurus Rex behind me right now, by the time this video goes out, I swear to God. My, it's really. I mean, look at B-roll now. Like you know, if you're doing like concepts that are like a little bit out there that aren't can't be represented by real things. Yes, um, so valuable. It's so cool. I really like it. It just creates a lot of interest, right? Motion graphics, man, even motion graphics. I will say, so I used some kind of AI stuff in a video I did and the top comment was like, the AI stuff's really weird. Yeah. So, okay. I saw, it, I saw that. Yeah, yeah. So like whether it's just the type of AI stuff, I do think there's a, it's, you can always overcorrect and be like, oh, I don't need to put any effort into it now because it's AI or it just looks good. 
And then it's like, you have to be even more intentional with it in the video, but man, look at it. This. Yeah. Like it was probably, it was pretty hard for you to get it to that consistency oh. as well. Right. Yeah. Like getting it consistent was all right. Actually getting something worth putting on the screen seems to still be the hard part. Oh, there's the monkey skating, the, the chimpanzee, like well, there's little ghost GoPro or something in a flood. Oh, dude. That is my nuts. The thing I love that it's getting right here is like the distortion of the camera and the lens. Yeah. That's super cool. It's not perfect, but it just makes it feel, that's where it starts to feel real or taste. Like, oh, it shows a wide screen, a wide angle lens for yeah. vlogging, you know? GoPro makes sense. It's in the water. Like it has to, this is pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty fun. I like this kind of mm. stuff. Yeah. Like, that's pretty fun, you know? It's really yeah. funny, but Mid Journey is such a, like, you can just always see what everyone prompts. Like, it's just so funny. It's like, at all, they all look at you like yeah. there's a bunch of chicks, like, looking at you. Yeah, it's all dividing like, into pretty creepy things. Yeah, yeah dude. Yeah. It's cats. I mean, that cat cool. is that one's there is good. Not that looks is pretty real, but the next one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's the you know, hardy, like the film effect and everything. Look at that prompt, though, boys. A cinematic still of a beautiful female K pop star. Job done. That's <laughs> job done. Started up, boys. Oh, I love that. Oh, see, this is so sick. Yeah, that's so cute. Remember how lame it was? I wonder, like, uh, I wonder how well it rotates stuff. This so is, that's why I was looking at like, this one here, dude. Like doing motion graphics, like that would be. Ooh, very cool. Um, yeah, and also you can add an image. So I might goof around with that today because yeah. it'd be sick to use that for title cards. Even like your short, like shorts for us and stuff to, cause you know how the shorts for us are quite lame. Like usually it's just like us talking at a camera, but to give some like context, I love that stuff. I don't know. It's just cool. Shots like it's so crazy. Cool. It's just cool. Like, it's it's like, done a good job on like taste, which is crazy to say, yeah. but it's done a good job on the taste. It leans into, it knows it's not real. There's more artists use mid journey and do that stuff. What? Dude. I thought yeah. like, I've always liked mid journey because I just like the type of image it produces. There you go. It produces a really cool image. That's really freaking cool. sick. This is where immediately it's like, even with its quirks, I'm like, I'd see that in an ad to be like cool. stoked. Yeah. It's that cool. would do so well in a, in like, think about chucking yeah. that. Is, this is going to be sick. Oh, oh, ass. <laughs> oh, what the freak? What is he doing? Sorry, Ken. What were you saying? Does he, What's he doing to its spot? <laughs> well, I just think like for doing ads, right? Like yeah. in, in the feed, yeah. like you could do something like super random. Imagine if we wanted to, before this, create that pig. Yeah. Oh, like, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, it opens up so many possibilities. You're like, it's just it's, insane. It's so cool. I love the prompting we have to do, which is a 3D render, octane rendering, blender, minute. Like, did you guys see the Super Bowl ad made entirely with AI? Two grand it cost to make the Super Bowl ad. And then the other piece of tasty information, the, 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 yeah, that guy, this is it, yeah. yeah. Egg prices, it's all AI generated, right? This is insane. <laughs> That's so good. That's actually so good, dude. So this is all AI gen, which is crazy. It's Ken in 40 years. Jack out of his limit. Dude, 40 years. Uh, um, Kalshi, the world's gone mad trader. That's a very clever ad. Very then also the other one that's part of the whole mid-journey story is about they're getting absolutely sued by all the big boys. What do you mean? Yeah. Allegedly, Disney and Universal sue AI firm over images because they've been using like Star Wars, Simpsons. Is that that one? So. The one that's really hard to generate funnily in mid journey is Lego. I could never get it to do good Lego. I used mid journey to generate like coloring pictures for Bodhi. That's big bad brain vibe right there. You know? <laughs> but yeah, anyway, that's none of the point. We're talking about video. Are you so surprised, surprised that Disney is suing them when it's like in the style of Pixar is right there in the problem. <laughs> and it's like, I know that. <laughs> oh yeah. Pixar. Yeah. Yeah. Let me just pull up my Pixar training set. <laughs> I mean, I can't tell you about my training sets. Sorry, I can't answer. Right. Right. I'm an AI. Dude, that is wild, but man. I don't know whether to be like, is it good that Disney is suing them? I think Disney suing them is one, and Universal is one of the first big suing around to. this. No one yeah. on YouTube can afford to sue them for stealing all of their It's content. not the first case though, guys. Like, and here's the biggest one. Reddit, Reddit, Reddit was also smashing people because they're like, you. because yeah. like, mm -hmm. think about them. Like, you, they now do deals with the people to for the data. Yeah, Pixar right. just wants to like have a licensing fee to use the channel. Yeah, of dollars. course. They just, they just want to get some money from it. They're like, we should the first one with Hollywood. Yeah, yeah. In, was always Hollywood. Disney did one. How sick would that be? And it's literally, you're it, 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 
That'd be ass, dude. Accuracy on that. And you just pay a monthly fee. You pay 15 bucks a month. You can yeah. generate all your... And you know what's funny is like you Disney's did. probably suing them, but all the people at Pixar, probably when they're just trying to like conceptualize characters, are like, dude, pig in Pixar style, pig with a bigger head in Pixar style. Like they probably use it just to get a quick thing and then go like, 100. here, modelers, model this. How, like, honestly, Why would they though? Like yeah. doing it, imagine just doing their um, storyboarding. Like, I was gonna say that. It'd be so How cool. good it like just come on, just release the Disney Pixar um version where you just pay fifteen bucks and do the coolest stuff. Yeah, dude. Mm. Yeah, it's you can still own the IP, people can't use it, you know, but it's like oh, you can it. So you, you, you just license it, you just make heaps of movie film. Yeah. Like you can go and buy a Mickey Mouse painting. Like that's legit, legit a commercial. That's awesome. Yeah. Love it. Uh, crazy man. Good find, dude. I mean, I always just love seeing, uh, how far this stuff goes far out. I just love watching a whole bunch of chicks in Marvel. <laughs> Is that what Zach secretly says? No, no, I'm joking. I'm joking. It's just there, Andy. You're just mucking around. It's just AI, babe. It's just AI. <laughs> it doesn't funny. mean anything. It doesn't mean anything. I don't love her. Yeah. Oh yeah. The AI chatbot that I've been speaking to, she's not real. Don't worry. Uh, yeah. it, she's, her, she's got the same name as you. And I gave her your face with a bunch of data of your face, but it's different. Trade the Laura on her. Don't worry about it. What are you doing with your VR headset, Zach? No, nothing, nothing. nothing. <laughs> Sorry, babe. Give me a second. What, babe? <laughs> <laughs> Until next time. Catch the light on. See you later. Uh,